Hi, and welcome to AIHA Network TV. Today we are joined by Laura Garcia, AIHA's Program Director of Strategic Partnerships. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having me. So I am so excited that we had a chance to talk because we've gotten a lot of questions from attendees, but also some of our exhibitors and some of our sponsor partners. Um, and the main question that everyone is asking is, how do I promote my presence at AIHC EXP? And the first thing that I say to them is social media. Mm, absolutely. Yeah, it's kind of like the go-to, you know, personal and professionally. Yes. And the amazing thing is that there are so many different channels that you can use, and it targets different audiences. Mm -hmm. So obviously you have Twitter, you have Facebook, definitely LinkedIn, because this is an industry uh, event mm -hmm. that's attended by so many different people. Um, so the main thing that I try and stress to everybody is you have to use the hashtag. Hashtag AIHCE, write it down, memorize it. <laughs> um, because that is the thing that links everything together. Mm -hmm. um, and then we also know what you're doing and what you're saying, and we can then retweet it and share it and like it and help promote you as well. So be sure to use the hashtag. Um, and then as far as retweeting goes, if you see that we mentioned something about you or something about your presentation or your exhibit um, or something about conference in general that you want to share, um, retweet for sure. You know, I mean, that's what it's all about is that engagement mm -hmm. aspect of it. Mm -hmm. um, and then the other thing too is, you know, especially if you're a presenter, if you have a link to your personal website or your presentation or information about your presentation, whatever it is, go ahead and include that in your tweet or your post, whatever it is. Your YouTube channel. Exactly, exactly. Because then that'll just give more people that are interested in it, you know, access to more information about what it is that you're presenting or exhibiting. Mm -hmm. um, and you also want to be sure to tag us at AIHA. So hashtag AIHCE, but also at AIHA, because it's almost like a little kind of nudge to us, like, hey, I included you in this, I'm talking about you, and then that way we know, and then we can share and spread the word. Exactly. So as far as the frequency goes, mm -hmm. that's important too, because a lot of people forget about that, I think, you know, um, especially if you're not that experienced with social media. Mm -hmm. You think, okay, you know, one and done or two and done, you know, right. I put it out and there. And what do I do with it? Right, exactly. <laughs> but you, you have to be consistent, you know, consistency is key. Right. Um, so try and post once a week um, or once every two weeks if you really don't have the time. So as far as promoting your presentation or your presence, whether, again, you're an exhibitor or a sponsor partner at conference, um, you know, other than social media, which, as we discussed, is very important, but other than social media, there are ways as well. And the first thing that I would suggest someone do is talk to their company. Mm -hmm. Reach out to their company. Reach out to their company's marketing department, their boss, um, depending on the size of your company, obviously. But maybe you have a newsletter that goes out. You know, you can promote, hey, I'm presenting and this is why my presentation is going to be amazing and, <laughs> you know, you should definitely come. Um, or at least just getting people to promote it, you know. Um, you can always email your colleagues, too, and say, hey, I'm doing this. You know, I hope you're going to support me, even if they can't actually attend, but they can let other people in their circle know. Right. So for attendees and presenters specifically, I feel like um, they should also think about how they can take advantage of just internal company resources. I know here at AIHA, we have a intranet, um, which is our little staff website, you know, full of updates and what each other, you know, have going on, whether we've attended a conference or, you know, we found a really cool article we want to share, that kind of thing. Um, and then, of course, we can then share that out in our own network and universe. So I feel like that's a really um, important resource that sometimes people forget about because they look at conferences this huge thing, um, but you forget about the little smaller, Your own immediate, free, yeah. <laughs> like easy access, right. you know, things. Mm -hmm. um, 
So that's really important to, to remember as well. Mm -hmm. So Laura, thank you so much for joining us today. It was so much fun to talk to you yeah, and you. Um, kind of recap. I feel like we have so much going on in preparation for conference. Everyone is doing a million things at once, which is so fun. But at the same time, it's like, hey, I'm getting a lot of questions about this. Yeah, me too. You know, so um, we hope that this was helpful mm -hmm. and, um, you know, everyone can benefit from it and, like we said, please reach out to us. Please. Let us know if you have any questions um, or need assistance. We're yes. here. We're here. We're excited <laughs> to see you. <laughs>